Hello, everybody. Uh, sorry, I, I'm a little bit late. I had some stuff that I needed to do last minute before streaming, but I'm here. Hello, Happy New Year, everybody. Um, and down here is in this little little area right here is uh, Haytham Kenway. Oh, and uh, I hope everybody's had a new had a good New Year and good holidays and all of that. Um, actually, before I forget, let me. Quickly pull up a thing, a thing that is important. It's an important thing. I want that. There it is. Okay. Um. Okay. So, hi everybody. Um, it has been a lot. What feels like a long ass time, and I'm again. I'm sorry. I'm a little bit later than I was hoping for today, but you know, it'd be like that. Um. Uh. The sorry, my own voice is distracting me right now. Um. The uh, I've had over the break. I've had some time. I've gotten a new mic stand. You know, so we don't have to worry about all the problems that my last one was having. Um, so there's probably new problems, but whatever. Um, same old mic, but I've done a little bit of tweaking. Um, I've done a little bit of tweaking of my setup in general. Uh, my camera, instead of being on top of my monitor, is now on its own stand. Um, you don't have to be, like, right that close to my face. Um, it's now on its own stand. Uh, it's kind of still resting on my monitor, but it's not reliant on the angled position of my monitor, so I can actually see my second monitor better. Novel thought. Um, instead of having it, like, tilted hard, hard angle, which is what it was before. Um, but, uh, actually, you're a little... Eh, right there. No, a little bit more. There we go. Um... And, uh, yeah, I've, I've, I've been able to do a little bit, a, a few things like that. Um, you, if you've paid any attention, you'll see that I've done a little bit of rearranging up here. Uh, Edward Kenway is now over here, right there, instead of over on this side right here. Because over here, I now have a Funko Pop of Grog. Grog Strongjaw. Um, but, uh, yeah, um... I also have a have a little uh, Grogu in his little bassinet thing, hover bassinet thing, um, over over here. Little, little Grogu, little baby Yoda guy. Um, anyway, uh, before we get started, um, let's let's all take a second and have. Oh, oh, my back needed that. Oh man, it was a series of cracks right up the spine. Woo! My back really needed that. Um, and of course, hydration. Hydration is important. I always shake my water before I drink it. <laughs> I don't know why. I just do. Um, but, uh, yeah. Oh, I do have some announcements. So... For those of you who may remember, I may have said a thing about having to return back to my normal schedule of like four to six for two hours a day type of uh, for two hours on Mondays and Tuesdays only. However, over the holidays, things have happened and I'm actually able to stream every day as much as I want. So I'm back to the obviously two to six rather than the four to uh, limited to the four to six. But also because of this, I am now officially going to be streaming almost every day of the week. That means that I, so, and so here's my schedule. You can see it on my Twitch channel. Um, I also posted about it on social media yesterday. Was it yesterday? Feels like yesterday. Hey, Rose, thank you for the resubscription. Hey, and welcome, welcome. Um, but yeah, so, <laughs> Uh, Mondays and Tuesdays will, will still be Assassin's Creed, Murder Mondays and Tomb Raider Tuesdays. Um, and then uh, Wednesdays, when I'm not doing Terraria with, actually, even when I might be doing Terraria with them. Um, on Wednesdays, I'll be playing some Mirror's Edge in addition to the Terraria. Um, the ter so the Terraria with uh, Yvonne B and Melador 219. 
links up here. Um, they are, uh, those are every other Wednesdays, right? So that would be the, that would be, we would be starting back this Wednesday, um, as an FYI. Um, so, uh, leading up to that time slot, so, like, there's gonna be, like, two or three hours beforehand, if I'm feeling up for it, um, I'll be streaming Mirror's Edge. Um, and then on the days that, days off of Terraria, I'll also be, I'll still be streaming Mirror's Edge. Uh, at least that's the intention. Unless I have other things come up. You know, life, life be that way. Um, and then... Thursdays, uh, due to the request of one of my viewers, I will be playing Lord of the Rings Shadow of Mordor and eventually its sequel, Shadow of War, on uh, Thursdays. Um... Also, there will be some uh, there will be some changes to the uh, to the Yvonne B D and D streams that uh, over on her channel. Um, instead of doing once a month at the end of the month, it will be twice a month. Um, so this week, uh, uh, this month, it'll be the fifteenth, and then the final month, uh, the final Saturday of the month. Um, I was just talking about D and D Rose, um, except it's Yvonne B's D and D stream. Um, I, I was getting to that <laughs> little, little known game called Dungeons and Dragons. Um, but yeah, that, that'll be uh table flip. <laughs> that'll be on the 15th, uh, uh, 15th for sure, which is this Saturday. And then two, uh, not next week, but the week after that, I believe. Um, and, uh. I am fully intending on starting my own D&D &D streams, which is what Rose is talking about in the chat over here, because I've talked to her about it, um, getting her in uh, as a player. Um, however, the unfortunate thing is that over half of my players are having very, very, very uh, chaotic lives right now. Um, and I could replace them, but I don't want to, because I want to play D&D &D with these people. Um, so we're gonna hold out and see how uh, we'll, we'll hold out till they get things a little bit steady and they can um <laughs> we'll hold out until they can get things a little bit more steady and see what's up with that um ah before i forget i almost forgot i can't believe i almost forgot i have a patreon now I did not set up the I did not set up an on-screen thing for it, but I have a patreon now It is now available in my link tree, which is right down here. Let me point at the damn thing right here I need to set up a I need to set up a I, I need I need to I need to do that. Uh, hold on. Let me make a Let me make a note so I don't forget one second y'all uh, Okay, I actually completed that checklist so I can um, da -da 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 Oops that oops sorry uh it's been a minute since i've up updated my to-do list um even though i made it two days ago um make on screen patreon thing make i'll know what i mean by that i'm sure uh chat command for patreon there we go i'll do that eventually uh probably tonight um ah i apologize for my nose i'm fighting a cold i promise it's nothing more serious than that i just tested negative twice so yeah no i i mean i do i do I do have a bot, but it's, um, it's, yeah, uh, I have it very limited. Um, I need to find my Patreon link. Let me do that real quick. Actually, I can just go to my link tree. Ha! Link tree slash Crimson Knight. Let's go. All right. Patreon. There we go. There's my Patreon link in the chat. Um, currently, there's only one tier. 
I will be adding more tiers as I have them. Um, but right now, basically, if you just uh, do a monthly $1 thing, you'll be helping me out a lot, by the way. Um, but, and I will greatly appreciate you. But if you do that, you will end up with your name and your, uh, us your username or your real name, whichever you prefer. Um, no tears, don't cry. I won't. I won't. Unless you actually give me money. And then I will love you all forever. I mean, I already love you all forever, but shut up. Um, hi, Yvonne. Glad you could make it. I'm just going through the uh, beginning of the year catch up, basically. Talking about my Patreon. Uh, if you subscribe to my Patreon at tier one, uh, which is only $1 a month, um, you can, uh, your name will end up in my credits page at the end of every, uh, every one of my streams and productions and stuff from this point, from the point that you sign up onwards. Uh, it'll be, you can choose either to have your username or your real name, whichever you prefer. Um, yes, yes, you do give me money through Twitch. I appreciate, that's, I wasn't, bro, stop it. <laughs> Stop it. I know you give me money. You're my subscriber. I under... This is how you get me to cry, okay? Start crying. Ah! <laughs> I will if I think about it too much. I genuinely will start crying if I think about it too much. Um... <laughs> People are too nice. I don't deserve it. But, um, anyway, uh, so yeah, Patreon link in the chat, um, I'll put it again, uh, right there. I would greatly appreciate anything you all can, uh, you all, you know, you know, it's not required. Sorry, I didn't mean to bump my mic then. Uh, it's not required at all. It's not, um, it's not necessary to access my Discord or anything like that. You get all, just like it's not necessary for you to subscribe to me Twitch, you don't, like, it's just an extra thing, you know, um, intent, um, eventually if I get enough, uh, patrons and things like that, um, when I have bigger tiers and things like that, um, like one of the bigger tiers that I end up in, I fully intend on having eventually is that I will dungeon master a game for you and, uh, some friends for one session. Um... Either that, or you will be able to guest star in my own D&D stream if that's happening by the time that that goes up. Um, yes. Yes, I know you ha you did. And I enjoyed each and every single drop of tears. <sighs> but yeah, so there's going to be a tier for that. Um, eventually, eventually. Because um, that, that would be quickly a lot. Um... I'm going to hold off on that until I actually have examples of me dungeon mastering out there so that people can be like, oh, I actually don't like his DM style or something like that. You know, that way you can choose whether or not you, you know, uh, you, you that way you have examples. That's what I'm going for. Um, also, I have some other plans in the work uh, that will come along when I have them. Um, I also have a few monetary goals. Any money that I earn from the Patreon will go directly back into this. It'll go into things like uh, hardware upgrades, um, game purchases, uh, uh, software upgrades, etc. Um, yes, like the Stabo in the Shadow. <laughs> um, but more often, uh, but yeah, anyway. Um, but more variety than just the Stabo in the Shadow, the Blades in the Dark. Um, but yeah, so like, Basically, any money earned from the Patreon, just just like from the Twitch streams, will go directly back into my content creation. And um, with that will be things like hardware upgrades and things like that. Um, anything that... Uh, so, like, one of the things is an upgrade to my internet service. Um... It'll make it, you know, eventually it'll make it, if I get, if I can get a certain amount a month, blah, 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 et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. It, it's not important. I just want to, your, your money will go towards the content, not towards my own, like, personal life and stuff like that. Um, so, 
yeah and expansion and things like that like if i get enough of an income eventually then i will fully intend on actually hiring people on to work on some extra stuff for me in the background like i'll actually get a uh um shit what was it uh i have plans i have plans and stuff will happen as money comes available if you know etc 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 um so that is what your money will go towards um if you it, you know if you subscribe to me here or if you go and if you pay on or if you subscribe to me on patreon eh. um that's what i forgot to do i forgot to take notes medicine oh well it's fine um actually hold on let me turn this off uh it's getting a little warm in here uh but yeah so i think that's actually it because i talked about my patreon i talked about my new schedule um and how i'm streaming every day more or less um i think that's it y'all you know what that means though y'all know what that means so i'm not sure i remember what it means <laughs> it's been a long ass time uh that means time to take a yeet of faith back into this bullshit. All right. Wait, why is my... I don't have audio. One moment. I know why. I know exactly why I don't have audio. Uh, Volume mixer. Thank you. No? Nope. I should have audio. I'll get to that in a second, Rose. I'm trying to figure out why I don't have audio. Oh, helps if my headset's actually on, doesn't it? There we go. There we go. All right, let me get that hydrate. There's my water bottle. Okay, now, time to get back on into this. Where was I? Don't mind me, guys. I just almost landed on you, but it's fine. Don't mind me. I would like to start the mission, please. Thank you. Evening, gentlemen. Charming. Oh, peace, Charles. He'll grow in you. Oi! Catherine, you fussock! Get back here! Daddy needs a drink. How fares the search? Nah, He's definitely a charmer. Cutting it. What of your local contacts? We'll need to earn their trust. Or they'll share what they know. <sighs> oh, I have an idea well. on how we might be affecting that. There's a man who's taken to enslaving natives. Rescue them, and they'll owe us. <laughs> Do you know where they're being held? Afraid not. Benjamin Churchwell. He's a finder and a fixer. He's also on your list. And there I was, wondering whom I might solicit next. Well done. Off to find... <laughs> Take me to church. <laughs> yeah. Bro was like neck deep in them titties. Oh, and I got some conversations up here that I want to have. <laughs> nah, actually he was deeper than neck deep. He was like shoulders deep. They are, indeed. Well, let me converse. Any news? Whispers of things. Nothing solid. His but... name is Hickey. I know you're looking for word of anything out of the ordinary. 
dealing with temples and spirits and ancient times and whatnot. But so far, can't say my boys have heard much. No trinkets or artifacts being moved through your shadow market? Nothing new. Couple His name is Hickey. That explains so much. From a living thing. For you said to listen for talk of glows and ums and strange sights, right? <laughs> and I ain't heard nothing about that. I'm pretty sure he's yeah. actually a historical figure. Oh, I could be wrong. Um, done a great if you don't mind doing a quick Google search to see if Thomas Hickey is a person from actual history. Twice fold if it pleases. Thank you, Thomas. Place to sleep and meal to eat is thanks enough. That moment when he's actually the origin of the term Hickey. Do you like it here, Charles? There's a certain charm to Boston, I suppose. To all of the colonies, really. Granted, their cities have none of London's sophistication or splendor, but the people are earnest and hardworking. They've a pioneer spirit I find compelling. It's quite something, really, watching a place that's finally found its feet. Has it, though? The French still wage war from up north. So and he was really a he was a real life person. Well. Is he actually the origin of the term world, hickey? Or just another battlefield? Ah, oh, that's a story old as time itself. And one probably did. Change. You probably did. We're cruel and desperate creatures, set on our conquering. Don't ways. post them in the chat. The Saxons and the Franks, the Ottomans and Safavids. I could go on for hours. The whole of human history is but a series of conflicts and subjugations. Don't mind me, I'm just knocking shit off my desk, it's fine. Desire for more and more and, and more. I pray one day we rise above it. Whilst you pray, I'll act. We'll see who finds success first, hmm? It was an expression. Aye, and a dangerous one. Words have power. Wield them wisely. He's probably not actually the origin. It's probably a bit more recent than that. I've some work I should finish. Let us speak later. All right. So he's all talked out. What about this other guy over here? What you got for me? This business with Silas confuses me. If Britain stands any chance of pushing back the French, they must ally with the natives, not enslave. We're in Boston, America, during the colonies. Arm the crown is irrelevant. So long as there are buyers for his product, he'll continue to procure it. All the more reason to stop him, then. My days are spent in Congress. Pre-revolutionary war. Attempting to convince them that we're the ones they should trust. That the French are merely using them as tools to be abandoned once they've won. Your words. Well, in Boston. Strength. That good old Boston. The reality of Silas' actions. I've tried to explain that he does not represent us. But he wears the red coat. He commands a force. I must appear to them either a liar or a fool. Likely both. We both. Take heart, brother. When we deliver them his head, they'll know your words were true. I hope you're right, Atham. You got any anything more for me, Hickey? When I know something, you'll know something. All right, Hickey. Fair enough. I will never stop being amused. Uh, when I went to visit Boston, um, there was a uh, on my on my on the day I was leaving, I was in the airport. Um, this was several years ago, right before COVID hit. Um, the uh, the um, here, let me let me tell the story. Uh, as I was leaving, I was in the airport out of Boston. There was a guy in front of me in line at the TSA getting his bags checked and, and, and like searched through and stuff. They opened the suitcase and it was full, and I mean full of bagels. Like each one, each individual bagel, individually Ziploc bagged in his thing. <laughs> And he was like, he, he was like, I, he, he basically was the TSA agent looked at him. He just gave him a look. And I, and the guy's just like, 
You can't get good bagels where I live. And I'm not talking like this is a tiny carry-on suitcase. No, this was a fucking massive ass suitcase. Like, I'm moving house-sized suitcase. And that was the only thing he had. <laughs> I will never forget that from the mo for uh, until I die, like for real. All right, let me go ahead and add a mark because Yvonne asked me to. Uh. Marker added. Wonderful. <laughs> I love how caught off guard by that Haytham was. Seems like we're not the only ones looking for Mr. Church. Damn it, he could be anywhere. What do we do? We find him. Reminder, that is Charles Lee. I'll show you how. As in that Charles Lee. Yvonne B. I'm a general. Wee -hee! Mr. Middle, even if we've the best of intentions. But if you could have seen us, they were surely drunk carrying on like that, and during the day, no less. And the curious public, Toby Locke will demonstrate tomorrow by the Belfry his latest. I'm getting tutorialized, y'all. Take me to church. Perhaps I should send someone to retrieve him before he damages his reputation beyond repair. They stumbled off to the northeast, no doubt in search of a tavern or some other place of ill repute. Start questioning those on the street. I'm no, no, I'm not a baby assassin, nor is Haytham a baby assassin. But the. Uh, but what it is, is the, it's a whole new, both within the universe. <laughs> ooh, ooh. The itty bitty baby Crimson. Ooh, ooh. Um, but yeah, no, what it is, is he's, um, because it's a whole new animus system in the universe and in the game, they're telling you how things work because I'm still at the beginning of the game, obviously. All right, so that's that's not the church I'm looking for. However, I must go to this church to find the church I'm looking for. Uh, let's see here. There's not appear to be a fast, an easy fast way down. That's okay. I'll just you know. Hello, sir. Just gonna. Oh, there we go. We're in no pi pirates are next game. We're in Assassin's Creed 3. 
when we're playing the remastered version of it. You know, Rose, if you actually looked down at the title of the stream, you'd see. But Pirates are the next game. Yar, Har, and Fiddle Dee Dee. Time to take a listen. With luck, one of those people knows what became of Benjamin. Oh, you can't see you can't see because you're on mobile. If you actually aren't lazy, I see how it is. You know you like it, Rose. I've asked the priors, but they all plead ignorance. Fuck of that! They're lying! Aye. Well, what can I do? Threats light off them, and I'll not deign to grovel. Actions speak louder than words, my friend. Arrest Ara -ara. <laughs> Without cause, we'll set them singing songs about us. That's a good girl. Last thing the city needs is town criers complaining about our abuse of authority. And forget it. A crime is done. A killer's gone. Those who know won't share their secrets. If the city wishes to harbor scoundrels, let them pay the price for it. Pardon me, coming through, don't mind me. Just gonna oop, just squeeze it on through here, it's fine. I'm gonna climb this real quick. Don't mind me, just gonna pop right on up here. Oh, trust me, I know you're a brat. Brats can be good girls too. Charles, we'll have church in no time, just as I said we would. If I might ask, sir, where did you learn to do all this? It is a requirement when you are raised in the manner that I was. Perception is fundamental to the order. It guides the feet when running and climbing, informs the hands when striking and fighting. But most important, it transforms the senses, and we begin to know the world in a different way. Well guarded. We need to slip past them. 
I was trying to pet the chickens and it wouldn't let me. I know you can. Okay. All right. Gonna. We're just gonna suss this out a little bit. If I tell you to wait here, will you actually cause a problem if I go too far out of range? Probably. Like I said. Hey, man. Come here. Oh, I didn't want on the horse. How do I get off the horse? Excuse me while I try to remember how to get the fuck off a horse. Dismount. There we go. God damn. Okay, sir, will you follow me? You don't appear to be. Oh, did I not tell you to follow me? There we go. Come on. There we go. Okay, so this guy's right down there. Okay. To be clear, have I been detected? No. Find the key. Wait here. It's just... Shit. That didn't work well. Nope. Well, no longer de undetected. Okay. Fuck. game again uh oh nope oh, that's not what I wanted come on attack me okay so that that blocks those okay come on attack me somebody so I can remember how to do this Nope, that's just that's just another smoke bomb. There we go. Okay. All right. Now, now then. Let's um Nope. This one? Yes, that one.
Can you tell I haven't played this game in over in over a month? In about a month, I mean. All right. Oh man, it didn't. It didn't refresh my uh, smoke bombs. That's okay. All right, that's okay. That's okay. I'm just gonna. What if I do? Hey, come on. Bruh, please? No? Come on. Here we go. Are you gonna come around here? Gonna drag you over here. All right, so that guy's facing the wrong way entirely. Cool. First try, first do first key. All right. Cool. 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 Here we are then. Uh. <laughs> Why must you always make these things so difficult, Benjamin? Merely provide me with recompense, and all shall be forgiven. I'll not pay for protection I don't need. Clearly, you do require protection. Else we wouldn't be here. How very gauche. How very gauche. Now, what shall we do about our guest? Maybe I'll take his hands. Put an end to his surgery. Surgery. I'll take his tongue. Put an end to his waggling. Or maybe I'll take his cock. Put an end to his fucking us. In case you didn't know, this was a mature rated stream. <clears throat> take all three. No, hold a moment. Perhaps I was hasty in refusing you earlier. I'm so very sorry, Benjamin. But that door has closed. Be reasonable, Silas. I rather think I was, but you took advantage of my oh. generosity. I, won't I mean, be fair. A fool a second time. Also fair. <sighs> I fear I lack the constitution to bear witness to such barbarism. Come find me when you're finished, Cutter. You'll regret this, Silas. Do you hear me? I'll have your head. Maybe mature rated isn't the thing. It's not for. It's not for uh, non-teenagers. <laughs> Quiet now. I need to concentrate on my work. Just a quick little swipe and no more ears. How's that sound, Mr. Church? At least I'll be spared more of your inane prattle. Hold still a minute. Who? Who are you? Haytham Kenway, at your service. I don't understand. Well, why are you here? Walk with me, Mr. Church, and all will be explained. Rose. 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 How dare you do this to me? <laughs> I have my first patron. Thank you. Th thank you, Rose. I appreciate it. Thank you. Um, I'm going to add you to my fucking credit screen right now god damn it uh 
do you prefer do you prefer what do you prefer um i put you in the credit screen as Do you prefer Rose or would you like me to put your real name or Okay. All right. One moment. Where is it? There it is. All right, it's been done. Thank you, thank you, Rose. I I genuinely really appreciate it. Dismisses the notification. Okay. I'll cry on screen on stream will not cry on stream <clears throat> Johnson's told me what you intend as it happens, the man who held me is the same one that you seek. His name is Silas Thatcher. That fancy lad is our slaver. Don't let his velvet tongue deceive you. A crueler and more vicious creature I've never known. What can you tell me of his operation? He hosts at least a hundred men, more than half of whom are redcoats. All this for some slaves? <laughs> all right. The man's a commander. King's troop in charge of the South Gate Fort. We need to find a way inside. Hmm, let me think on it. In the meantime, I'll attend to our final recruit. John Pitcairn's our man. I'll take you to him. State your business. New recruit. More kindling for the pyre, eh? Well, go on then. How'd you manage that? Did you forget, sir? My commission is with General Braddock. When I'm not attending to you, of course. treacherous give me one good reason i shouldn't kill you right now were you planning to announce yourself or did you hope my men Sir, wouldn't notice your if arrival you'll allow me to explain <laughs> oh, oh, by all means i should like very much to hear this i have not deserted sir i am here under commander amherst's orders show me a letter bearing his seal and you might be spared the gallows I have no such thing. The nature of my work, sir, it's... It's the sort of thing best not put to paper. Hate them. General Braddock? I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. Wolves often travel in packs. 
Master Pit Ken won't be here for but a few weeks. I shall return him to his proper post once. Thanks for the lurk, Yvonne. The devil's work, no doubt. It's bad enough my superiors have insisted. I grant you use of Charles. But they said nothing about this traitor. You'll not have him. Edward, listen to reason. We're done here. See these gentlemen out. Well, that didn't go as I expected. And to think I used to call him brother. What now? Well, they'll chase us off if we try and return. We're done with this camp. And as luck would have it, so are they. Come along. What are you planning? To steal Master Pitcan. What? You'll see. Now. Give me just a second while I look something up. Right, okay. <clears throat> when I give the signal, you're to distract Braddock's patrol and lure them into a dead end. You thieves and scoundrels, one and all! Boy on you and your false war! <laughs> After him! Unhand him, Edward. Ah, uh, you again. Let us go. And John Pitt can with us. <laughs> I will not have my authority challenged. Nor I. Put them all in chains. Oops. I stayed my hand today because you were once my brother, and a better man than this. Ouch. Or should our paths ever cross again? All debts. I'll have to redo that again later because um, I didn't see the notification that I needed to prevent the. <clears throat> 
Go on, then. Join them on their fool's errand. And when you find yourself... On the, uh, I assume you've good reason for snitches. What is it you require of me? I'll explain everything on the way. I love Braddock still ranting in the background and they're walking away. All right, let me. Yeah, I missed. I missed a couple of things. I missed. Yeah, I missed. Yeah. Uh, sequential kill streak, prevent snitches from calling reinforcements and complete all objectives. Eh, I'll get it eventually. Um... Let me check something here. I'll fill this map out eventually. Um... I'll probably I'll do it before next week probably. Um But I want to go have this conversation before. Oops. No. Hate them. Drop. No. How about you get out of the water the wa water there. Bottom? Bottom, 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 bottom. Pupper? Pupper? Whiny pupper? Come here. No, no. No, no. Not that button. Okay, hold on a second. Okay, because I need that there. That there. That there. Pupper, come here. Can I? I want to pet. I want to pet the doggo. Yeah, boy. You can pet the pupper. Okay. <clears throat> Get out of the thing. I'll cost you in a second, Ben. Mm, maybe, but I want to get. are all locked for now uh, and, uh, yeah sure I'll go ahead and buy that oh nope can't afford it all right oh good old Benny what you got for me let us speak later my friend okay that's all you got all right All right. Ah, there is a uh, viewpoint here. Let me get this since I'm here.
If I may, I was curious about your past with Braddock. You two clearly have a history. Edward was one of us upon a time. <clears throat> I considered him a close friend. He was brave and bold in ways few men are. But everything changed at the siege of Bergen op Zoom. We had lost the fortress to the French and were in the midst of egress. There was a skiff hidden at the port with which we planned to make our escape. As we drew near, a young man and his family came upon us, begging for safe passage. I consented, but Edward refused. The young man called him Craven then. So Edward killed him and all the rest, even the children. To this day, I don't know why. Was this the first time he'd struck out? Or had I simply never seen it before? Either way, things were never the same after that. We campaigned together a few more times, but each outing was more disturbing than the last. He killed, killed. Enemy or ally, civilian or soldier, guilty or innocent. It mattered not. If he perceived one to be an obstacle, they died. He maintained that violence was a more efficient solution. It became his mantra. And it broke my heart. I had no idea. He hides it well, and intimidates into silence any who discover him. Those who persist have a tendency to find... misfortune. And we should stop him. I suppose you're right. But I maintain a foolish hope that he might yet be saved and brought back round to reason. I know, I know. It's a silly thing to believe that one so drenched in death might suddenly change. I'm sorry to have brought us up. It was not my intent to sour you. Nonsense. We are brothers now. There should be no secrets between us. I should return to my studies. I hope you and the general find a way to patch things up. Hey, Hickey. Got no office to give at Karen. When I do, you'll be the first to hear it. So, a question for you. Why medicine? I'm supposed to tell you I care for my fellow man, right? But I chose this path because it allows me to accomplish the greater good. Only hickeys. Are these things not true? Perhaps, but that's not what guided me, no. For me, it was a less abstract. I like money. There are other paths to fortune. Uh, what better where to peddle than life? Nothing else is as precious nor so desperately crave. And no price is too great for the man or woman who fears an abrupt end. Permanent end. Your words are cruel, Benjamin. But true as well. You took an oath to help people, did you not? I abide the oath which makes no mention of price. I merely require compensation, fair compensation, for my services. And if they lack the required funds? Then there are others who will serve them. Does a baker grant free bread to a beggar? Does the tailor offer a dress to the woman who cannot afford to pay? No. Why should I? You said it yourself. <laughs> Nothing is more precious than life. Indeed. All the more reason one should ensure they have the means to preserve it. Hey, Tim, you've gathered some uh, real trash bags here, you know? I have some ledgers to review. Do you mind if we speak later? Before we start this uh, this mission, I'm going to take a brief intermission because uh, I have to go pee. So I will be right back.
I'm back. Let's get back on into this. Gentlemen, I believe I found the solution to our problem. Or rather, Odysseus has. Oh, do you? Are you new guy? The Greek hero, you lobcock. Allow me to explain. We enter Silas' fort under the pretext of kinship. Once inside, we spring our trap, free the captives, Kill the slaver. <laughs> dodgy, dodgy. I like it. Then, let us begin. First, we need to find ourselves <clears throat> a convoy. Convoy should be here soon. We'll attack on my signal. Understood, sir. If we time this right, we can catch them all unawares. In today's one penny Boston Country Journal. <laughs> And pardon, sirs. Seems we've had ourselves an unhappy little accident. Get it sorted and quickly. Of course, my lord. At once. Charles, you and Williams serve as vanguard. Let no man reach us. What about me? You and John will follow from a distance and keep watch over us. I'll signal you when I have need of your services. We're here to help you, along with those held inside Southgate Fort. Free me. Not until we're inside the gate. I can't chance an inspection of the gate going wrong. I'll see you safe. You have my word. Words, you're white man. Words worth do dog shit. Do you know anything of Silas' operation? How many men we might expect? The nature of their defense. <clears throat> you must be rather important to him if you are given your own escort. Sir, we have enemies ahead. Shall I engage them? No. Let Jonathan and Thomas take care of it. As you wish. I wish you'd trust us. Though I suppose it's only natural for you to be wary. So be it. Where is Lieutenant Jones? What's the meaning of this? 
Engage the enemy. Why'd you kill the damn dog, Hickey? Your dog wasn't doing nothing. I just being a doggo. Aha! Bringing fresh meat, eh? Come here. I wanna take a look before silence. On your guard, man. Of course. Only say the word and I'll cut that. them down. Me and you. Who's your officer? Engage the enemy! All clear! They killed the doggo! For no reason! gentlemen state your business delivery for silas go on then. see i'm freeing you just as i said i would now if you'll allow me to explain let her go She'll give us away. No, she won't. What's the plan? Free the captives and avoid detection. What of Silas? He dies. I know when you're ready to strike. Form stealth assassinations from a corner spot three times. Can do. Just last week, in fact. And you're to patrol with us. So said Silas. Mm. I assume it's all rather straightforward. Watch for disturbances. Ensure order is maintained. Mm. Merchandise? If you don't know, you don't need to. As soon as you've been told, I'll stay out of our way. change of pace from the campaigning back home. Why do you think so many of us volunteer? Good pay, safe work, a chance to own some land. Rent would see an end to that. I don't know. It just seems to be tempting everyone. Come to the while we were provoked. Shit. And there was detection. Damn it. I should have just been patient instead of trying to whistle. You know, sometimes patience pays off. Sometimes. <clears throat> okay, so where is the officer? 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 Hmm. 
Just gonna loot these real quick. No, okay. There you go, Hatham. <clears throat> Oi, fellas. Apologies for me tardiness. Cutter had me working late. You know Cutter? <laughs> well, who do you think got me this post? We'll okay, I have to find and kill the general. Now, what's this Silas want us doing? We're to wrap up the prisoners, relieve them of their finery. I hear some of them carry real silver. Wouldn't mind helping myself to a bit of it before we send them on their way. No, keep clear of the merchandise. Don't speak of it either. We watch the gates and patrol the grounds. Understood, boss. I am yours to command. Oh, Hickey. I want to find the general and kill him. Stop slouching, soldier. Beg pardon? I said stop slouching. slouching. What are you, you to tell me what to do? Prisoner. A good friend of Mr. Fax's. Who are you? Oh, prisoner? I, I see. There are no prisoners. My apologies. Oh, I Be clear with your tongue in the future. The fellas we talk. Certainly, they sir. They do not exist. Upon my honor. Understood. And if they did exist, who would not? There he is. Coming? Come on, sir. Come on, General, let's go. We ain't got all day. we free these guys get out of the haystack Hatham come on you have all day don't you work today No work today? Do you have today off? Quiet was all I asked. Instead, I'm awakened not ten minutes later by this cuck cop mm. and his madness. Fair. I expect an explanation, and it had best be good. You still working where I last knew you were? How? How did this happen? My precious merchandise <clears throat> set free. It's unacceptable. You've been slacking. Fair. Rest assured, I'll have the heads of those responsible. But first, first we clean up this mess. Seal the fort, kill any who try to escape. I don't care if they be one of us or one of them. To approach the gate is to be made a cause. Them. Have I understood? Push them back. Okay, hold, hold that thought. Sorry. I have a D20 here on my desk and it's, um... It, I keep knocking it off of my where off of my
I, ro I rolled mediocrely. It was in the 10 to 12 range. Like 11 or something like that. I didn't really look. With my natural modifier of negative 10 to everything, so, you know. Might as well have been a natural one. <clears throat> Aw, he got a smirk. She giving him that smirk. What happens that now? Smirk. We wait. But not for very long, I suspect. <laughs> do, 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 do. We don't talk about Bruno. Memory sequence two completed. It's been several weeks now since we freed the Mohawk prisoners from <laughs> captivity. I had hoped their leader might make contact, but there's been only silence. My men grow restless. They want to know what comes next, and I do not have an answer. Lee alone remains active. Pursuing leads, however slight, he stalks the city streets and scouts the bordering woods, hopeful that he might make contact with one of those we saved. There was a woman there that night. It was she who helped the others to safety. If we can find her, I believe I'll have my answers. So, I watch and wait, hopeful that my true mission might finally begin. Boston, The Great Molasses Flood. Well, considering they probably won't return to America for a long ass time, if ever. Sorry, but I've some work needs doing. Okay, Benny. Okay, Benny boy. Got some work that needs to be doing. Okay. Especially as far as Assassin's Creed is concerned. Um, you like the verticality of then the climbing and the parkour ability and stuff. Though if they did come back, it would probably be uh, California-y stuff. Like the West Coast rather than the East Coast because they've already done the East Coast. Though what I would really love for them to do is South America. South or Central, specifically. Uh, maybe something to do with the Aztecs or the Inca or the... Shoot, what's that other group? Um, I don't remember. Huh. 
What was I doing? I could go over there. Um, 350. I'll hit this. I'll hit these two viewpoints and then I'll run, then I'll go to the objective. Yeah, sure. Dive into the Boston Bay in the middle of winter when there's snow on the ground. That's smart, Haytham. Haytham be like, the cold never bothered me anyway. Don't worry. I won't be here long. There you go. Hi guys, bye guys. Ouch. Don't mind me, just coming through. Woof, woof, woof. A woof, 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 woof. Ouch. The old state house. Look at him standing there like a badass. Oops. Here we go. This is what I'm looking for. <clears throat> Hello, Charles. Any luck finding our mystery? Word is she's been stirring up trouble just outside the city in a town called Lexington. Well, then that's where we'll begin our search. I'll meet you there. Lexington. <laughs> oh, Papa! Papa! You're such a good boy. Such a good boy. 
You're in your big stretch. Okay, so you'll jump the fence, but you won't jump down there. <sighs> but over here. There you go. Come on, let's go. Pardon me, pupper. Here go. Kite. Kite. Ooh. Ah, oh, come on. Let's see, how close am I to my objective? Not that far, actually. Good, good, good. Oh, there is a fast travel location. That would have been nice to know about. Helps if I look at the map before I go places, doesn't it? Bro, what you looking at there, man? What, what? It's a stone wall, sir. There you go. There. Nope, that's a stone wall still. What did it do? Bite your butt? Leave it alone. Because you're getting obsessed about a stone wall, man. Oh, wrong way. Wait, what? No, I was heading the right way. I was this way.
Booty biting? Always. Ang, 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 ang. Eat that ass. Eat it. Eat it. Hi, hi, Queen. Welcome. Welcome to the stream, Queen. Glad you could make it. Put the thing so I can see it better. She probably heard me say that because she's been watching for like four, like seven minutes. It does sound fun to bite somebody's butt, doesn't it, Queen? I'm glad you agree. Hang on. Put the sword away. Or start the mission, whichever. Have you found her? Uh, she's made camp not too far from here. Excellent. You hear that, Yvonne? The Queen well, agrees with me. <laughs> the sooner we can get out of this cold. I'm afraid I have some bad news, sir. Oh? Braddock is insisting I return to service under him. I've tried to beg off to no avail. No doubt he's still angry about losing Pitcairn. To say nothing of the shaming we gave him. Do as he asks. Oh, shoot. In the meantime, I'll work on having you released. Not your fault. Fire's <laughs> only just been snuffed. Snow recently disturbed. She's close. Onyx. The tracks are fresh. It must be hers. Mm. Seems she took to higher ground. Out of the snow and into the trees. She says hi but she says by the way hi Yvonne She says gotta roll with the punches with me and it, it not wrong <laughs> Wait here. 
Come back! Do you return to Braddock, Charles, before he grows suspicious? I can handle things from here. But, sir! But nothing! Go! Stop running! I only wish to talk! I am not your enemy! Please just hear me out! God's woman! Only let me speak! It... Oh, so much for health loss. A second i can do better than that wrong way this way i can do better than that that was that was childish Try my patience, woman! Okay, so I'm not allowed to run in the trees. Desi, good to see you. Glad you could make it. Welcome to Assassin's Creed 3. Are you touched in the head? Yes, Me? yes he is. Hatham. I come in peace. Why are you speaking so slow? <sighs> Sorry. What do you want? Well, your name, for one. I'm Godzid Zio. Well, pleased to meet you. God, God's day. Just call me Zio. Dio. Zio. 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 Now tell me why it is you here. Where did you get this? From an old friend. I've only seen from Amazon. Things in one other place. <laughs> Where? Actually, I got this as a gift, so technically, oh, I could say from an old friend. <laughs> I saved your people. Does this mean nothing to you? Look, I am not the enemy. Close to here, there is a hill. Meet me there, and we'll see if you speak the truth. <laughs> yeah. Yvonne, mutter, muttering about, in, intense muttering about colonizers. And what was awesome, Desi? A town host soldiers who seek to drive my people from these lands. They're led by a man known as the Bulldog. Edward Braddock. You know him? He is no friend of mine. Every day, more of my people are lost to men like him. Then I suggest we put a stop to it. Together. What do you propose? That we kill Don't use the word propose. But first, we have to find him. I don't trust you. I know. Good. Yet you remain. But I might prove you wrong. It will not happen. So you say. So I know. 
Yet, I remain. Oh, when she said the why are you talking so slow? Yeah, absolutely. You want to know the best thing about this game? Will it let me do it? Or will it? Or no. Because she's... Ah! Oh, no, it won't let me. You, you can pet the animals. You can pet the animals in this game. It won't let you when you have someone following you. Around. Oh, he's following! Yes, you're good to go. Jungle boy. Wait here. A mohawk man is likely to raise suspicions, if not muskets. This is hardly the first time I've been amongst your people. I can handle myself. She is so badass. I love her. I love her. She is so badass. Crashing of the waves, the sting of the salt in the eyes, and the goddamn gulls shrieking and shitting everywhere. You're sure that's where we're going? Aye, the bulldogs putting together another expedition. That's what they're calling them now, expedition. Aye, smart too. Slap a fancy name on something, and all evil is excused. Well, I took a little too much of an direct approach. All right. Can't stand being quartered there. The endless crashing of the waves, the sting of the salt in the eyes, and the goddamn gulls shrieking and shitting everywhere. You're sure that's where we're going? Aye. The Bulldogs putting together another expedition. That's what they're calling them now. Expedition. Aye. Smart too. Slap a fancy name on something and all evil is Hello, excused. Zio. I hear tell the French are ready to move in our positions. Wonder what Braddock intends to do about it. He's already left for the advance camp. I'll wager our little holiday here is just about ended. We'll be marching south before weeks end. Where are you going, Cully? Me? No, the other cock robin. Well, I, um, uh, I was leaving. Oh, and now? Well, now, I'm going to feed you your teeth. And you were worried I was going to be the problem? <laughs> I love her so much. All right, so first off, we want unarmed and spoke bombs so I don't accidentally kill anybody. But before we get into this, I have to run to pee, so I will be right back, y'all. Uh...
right, and I'm back. I timed that out with the ad very well. It was not intentional. But let's uh let's feed some British soldiers some teeth, shall we? bleeding that wasn't necessary but thank you we should move on meet me at braddock's camp when you're ready Okie dokie, so we need to go down here. All right. Let me get my horse whistle. Colonial era Boston region. Rabbits. Bunnies, bunnies, bunnies. Bunnies. Oh, 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 oh. But, my, no, no, no. There you go. Ah, there's a bridge. Pardon me, fellas, coming through. Doggos. Wait, because I couldn't do it before. Let me do it now. Doggos? Doggos. Hey, pupper. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. He's such a good boy. You too. You're also a good boy. Also a good boy. Such a good boy. All right, and now we get on the horse because we got places to be. We don't want to disappoint. We we don't want to disappoint the uh, nice lady and make her wait. The nice badass lady. And make her wait. Oh dear. I didn't, I didn't, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Come on. There you go, horse. Come on. Avoid the trees. Let's go. Oh, that's, that's the button I wanted to push. My bad. Get on the horse. We have aminals in this game. Ooh, a couple people died here. Uh, bridge over here Or could I just I can just run across here cool 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 Sup gents
Use the snowstorm to mask your approach. Having second thoughts? Hardly. But I'll have to approach this carefully. Go on then. I'll keep watch from here. Blankets, a cart to feed to the horses. What else? That's it. That's all there is. Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Perhaps I could sabotage them. Just a second. Let me from home with our forces divided. Worse, I fear Braddock's bloodlust makes him careless. It puts the men at risk. I'd rather not be delivering grim news to mothers and widows because the bulldog wanted to prove a point. Where Here the comes the general. The troops. And then it's on the north and cane, I assume. Eventually. The march north will surely take time. There's a copy of the plans in the command tent should you wish to review them at least this will be ended soon i tried john i know my friend i know that map will surely be of use i need to find it <clears throat> george washington hey you come here we're just gonna oh oh that's okay that's okay that's okay. Helps if I actually read my things, doesn't it? It's fine. It's fine. We have time. It's fine. It's fine, y'all. It's fine. Don't kill him with a weapon, which means I have to use my hands. Fair enough. Those cannons are like to cause... Okay. Now give me this. Okay. <clears throat> Perhaps I could sabotage them. It's okay. It's okay. All right. All right. Let's see now. Now we just go up here. Oh, oh, caught on a barrel. It's fine. It's fine. Haytham, hide. Haytham, why aren't you hiding? There we go. Let's just sabotage this cannon real quick. And then, you know, ya yeet. Ooh, that was almost bad. And failed. <sighs> okay. 
yeets self off cliff trying Those to get a shortcut. Like to cause trouble. Perhaps I could sabotage them. All right. Let me make sure I have unarmed. Okay, and just come here. Come here. Shh. 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 It's okay. One there. It's okay. It's okay. Go to sleep. 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 All right. It's okay. Now you don't need to be worrying about what's over here. You wor you worry about the outside. Now I'm just gonna come over here and interact. One down. Okay. Stay out of the big ass circle. Staying out of the big ass circle. All right. Now we're just gonna. Nope, wrong button. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Come here. Just, just you know. You look tired. Have a nap. It's okay. Just, 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 it'll be fine. Nice, nice, nice cold nap in the snow. It's okay. It's okay. Just, 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 you know. Shh. <clears throat> hey, Yvonne. Here comes the general. I drew too much attention. Those cannons are like to cause trouble. <sighs> okay. Them. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. It's fine. We're just going to do the exact same thing, just a little bit faster. And without fucking up there at the end. Oh, hi. You were not who I expected to get, but that's okay. Just going to spread my ass over here. Oops. And I fucked up. Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Perhaps I okay, could nice and slow. Do it nice and slow. Come on. Fine. Just, 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 shush, 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 shush. It's fine. And then we're just gonna pick you up a little bit. And... Drop you in the weeds. You'll be fine. Okay. I'm being impatient. That's what's killing me. I'm trying to rush and I'm being impatient. It's fine. Come here. Come here. It's fine. It's fine. Just, 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 shush, 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 shush. And just loot your pockets. It's okay. You don't need those eight pounds anymore. Brim. All right. And now we just go right back the way we came. Come here. Time for your nap. Alright. 
Let's what you got on you, huh? 14 pounds. Hey, you ain't half broke. Are you going to come here? Nope. Okay. That's okay. I'll just, I'll just... Shh. You look tired. You deserve a rest. You've been working hard. All right. And now we get this cannon. <clears throat> and now I will trigger the eavesdrop. Diplomatic solution was no solution at all. The pride of Mount Vernon. Retreat would only delay an inevitable conflict, one in which they now have the upper hand. There's merit to those words, as much as I hate to admit it. Still, can't you see this is unwise? It doesn't sit well with me either. We're far from home with our forces divided. Worse, I fear Braddock's bloodlust makes him careless. It puts the men at risk. I'd rather not be delivering grim news to mothers and widows because the bulldog wanted to prove a point. Where is the general now? Rallying the troops. And then it's on to Fort Duquesne, I assume? Eventually. The march north will surely take time. There's a copy of the plans in the command tent should you wish to review them. At least this will be ended soon. I tried, John. I know, my friend. I know. That map will surely be of use. I need to find it. Hey, look! Completed! Finally. What is the best way out of here? I'm gonna yeet over here. Oop, nope. Nope, it's fine. Damn it! Once again, got impatient. Come on, reload. Those Game says no. I like to cause trouble. Uh, okay. Perhaps I could sabotage them. Come here. All right. Well, at least it doesn't make me have to go through all of that conversation again. I just have to escape the fort and sabotage the cannons, but escape the fort. I'm just going to interact with this real quick. And since I'm going to... Oh, don't die. Okay, you're fine. Walk it off. Walk it off. All right. Oh, too soon. Just crouch down a little bit. And... Okay, now then. Hmm, nope. Okay. You saw nothing. Fuck! Okay. Hate them, you gotta stay in your hiding spaces, man. Fighting. Those cannons are like to cause trouble. Perhaps I could sabotage. Them.
It's gonna pop you in there. Gonna grab your ass real quick. Yep. Uh huh. Yep. All right. And then, oh wait, interact. There you go. Now, Haytham. I suggest you release the wall. Come here. Oh, I see my bet. I, I see my best bet is a way out of here. I see it. I see my route. I see the matrix. Here he comes. Come here. It's fine. Just gonna have a have a nappy. That's okay. All right. Uh, just to double check. Do not kill anybody with a gun. Uh huh. All right. And there we go. See, I was just being impatient. It's fine. I love that she's just chilling in like a snow drift up to her hips. What news? Braddock has left to rally his troops. They're marching on Fort Duquesne. It'll be a while yet till they're ready, which gives us time to form a plan. No need. We will ambush him here near the river. Go and gather your allies. I will do the same. I will send word when it is time to strike. God, she's good. Come on, here we go. Boss whistle. Hey, buddy. Can, can you a horse, please? Thank you. All right. The cold, cold ground. Here, here. Our 
hard at work, I see. How did you... <laughs> it is time. We've set up camp to the north. Meet me there. She is so badass. Gentlemen, let us away. Hickey barely standing up, right? <clears throat> First it was too cold. Now it's too goddamn hot. And humid too. It's a right swamp, I tell you. Nothing to the Where are we on the map? Ah, okay. So we went from. Yeah, this is Boston. We went up north a bit. Bugs are soon to be the least of our worries. What? You mean the bulldog? <laughs> Please. We'll be in that one's beef soon enough and on to the next. Where's your boy Lee gone up to? Returned to finish out his service under Braddock. I imagine the Bulldog's none too pleased after the stunt we pulled. Pleased to spin a tale of my incompetence and beg forgiveness. He is away with words, especially when it comes to flattery. I expect he'll be welcomed back with open arms. Which would give us a man inside. Precisely. Unless you've underestimated our enemy. If I have, Charles will sense it first and make his escape. He's more clever than you think. When this is done, I'm taking a week in New York. It's high time I went and saw the sights. Of empty whiskey bottles and women's britches. Okay, I'm, I'm going to hang out with these guys so they can finish talking. <laughs> <laughs> what other kinds of sights is worth seeing? Okay, you guys done? All right, cool. All See you've been busy. All these men are from many different tribes, united in their desire to see Braddock sent away. The Abenaki, the Lenape, the Shawnee. And you? Who do you stand for? Myself. What would you have me do? Well, you will help the others to prepare. Follow. They come. Everything all right, sir? George Washington. Just savoring the moment. No doubt, many wonder why it is we've pushed so far west. These are wild lands as yet untamed and unsettled. But it shall not always be so. In time, our holdings will no longer suffice. And that day is closer than you think. We must ensure our people have ample room to grow and further prosper, which means we need more land. The French understand this and endeavor to prevent such growth. They skirt around our territory, erecting forts and forging alliances, awaiting the day they might strangle us with the noose they've built. This must not come to pass. We must sever the cord and send them back. This is why we ride. To offer them one last chance. The French will leave. Or they will die. Now is the time to strike. Wait. To scatter the expedition is not enough. We must ensure that Braddock falls. Else he's sure to try again. I'll disguise myself as one of his own and make my way to his side. Your ambush will provide the perfect cover for me to deliver the killing blow. signal there in front of us
Well, I triggered open combat. fail the thing no so that means I still have opportunity okay now I've failed it it's fine I'll come back and do it later crap fucking horse go forward damn it it's a clear path man Ooh, it's raining <clears throat> I hear the beaver pelts they gather fetch a fine price back home. Panther, you mean. Sir? You are grateful to ha. Edward. Not so fun on the other end of the barrel, is it? Look out! Sir. Where are you off to, Edward? Well, I'm failing all of the things right now. Uh, fine. I'll do it later. Coward, Edward. Come on, then! Such arrogance. I always knew it would be the end of you. Is the end of you. Don't. Hurry before he gets away. Do I need a nap? Why are you asking that? I don't deserve this. Oh, because I'm failing the things? You're a hypocrite, Tatum. I'm sorry, Edward. But you forced my hand. No, I'm just... It's not that I'm tired. It's just my... Timing is not on point right now. And part of it is because I'm still very rusty at this game. Your death opens a door. Nothing personal. Well, maybe just a little personal. Been a pain in my ass after all. But we are brothers in arms. Once, perhaps. No longer. Do you think I've forgotten what you did? those innocents slaughtered and for what it does not engender peace to cut your way to resolution wrong whether we applied the sword more liberally and more often the world would be a better place than it is today in this instance i concur Uh, 
Farewell, Edward. Farewell, Edward. Just took his ring. It's done. Now I have upheld my part of the bargain. I expect that you will honor yours. Follow me. No, no. You seem disappointed. I thought that I held a key that would open something here. This room is all there is. I expected more. The door is not for you, Haytham. What do they mean? It tells the story of Yotzitzizu, who came into their world and shaped it for what life might come. She had a hard journey, fraught with great loss and peril. But she believed in her children and what they might achieve. And though she is long gone from the physical world, her eyes still watch over us. Her ears still hear our words. Her hands still guide us. And her love still gives us strength. You have shown me great kindness, dear. Thank you. I... I should go. Oh, no quick time event for that. Yo, imagine. I'm sure there's a game somewhere that does that. Probably on a very specialized site. <clears throat> Don't Google it. Don't do it. Don't Google it. <laughs> a few days later. Master Kenway, did you find it then? I found the promised the right land place. for sure, but it was not the right place, but it was not what we were looking the for. The <laughs> waiting for you. Gentlemen. <laughs> sit. I fear our temple was no more than a painted cave. Although it did contain precursor images and script, which means we are close. Not close enough, it seems. We need to redouble our efforts and expand our order and establish a permanent base here. <coughs> Although the site eludes us, I am confident we will find it. Truth. Here, here. Furthermore, I believe it is time we welcome Charles into our fold. He has proven himself a loyal disciple and served unerringly since the day he came to us. He should be able to share in our knowledge and reap all the benefits that such a gift implies. Are any opposed? Very well. Charles, come, stand. Do you swear to uphold the principles of our order and all that for which we stand? I do. And never to share our secrets nor divulge the true nature of our work. I do. And to do so from now until death, whatever the cost. I do. 
then we welcome you into our fold, brother. Together, we will usher in the dawn of a new world, one defined by purpose and order. Give me your hand. You are a Templar. May the Father of Understanding guide us. May the, May the Father, Father of Understanding, of understanding guide, us. Guide, us. guide us. Wait, what? General Lee was a Templar. Wee hee! Insert obvious Hamilton reference here. Hi, Desmond. You all saw that, right? Wow. Wow, indeed. The key must be the amulet Haytham took from London. We might know what it looks like, but we're no closer to finding it. Desmond, you need to keep going. Hey, he's your ancestor, too. Why don't you hop in the Animus? Really? That's your response. It's like dealing with a six-year-old. What is wrong with you, Desmond? You want to know what's wrong? I'm sick of being treated like I'm not even here. Desmond, do this. Desmond, do that. Desmond, you better figure things out because the sun is going to turn us all to ash. And I know I was really nice to you, but actually I'm just another Templar plot twist. And yes, I would like very much for you to be controlled by a magic space wizard so that you can murder me. So there's your answer. I'm sick of being a goddamn pawn. I thought it might be different with you. I mean, you're my father, but it turns out you're no better than the fucking Templars. <sighs> Don't you ever equate me to those bastards again. You hear me? Everything I do, everything I have done, has been for you. Maybe I pushed a little too hard, asked a little too much, but try and remember exactly what's at stake here. You need to get it together, kid. We're running out of right. time. Right, was unusual. Well, I'm just going to pretend that this never happened and get back to bringing everyone up to speed on where we stand. The news isn't good. It appears this temple is powered by a collection of, um, well, I guess they're batteries. You found one on your way in, but there aren't any more, at least not down here. Any idea on where we can find replacements? Not yet, so I intend to tiptoe into the Abstergo database. Now, if I can cross-reference these particular devices with their database, then maybe we'll get lucky. See what you can do. Obviously. Anyway, Desmond. We can either take a look around here, or we can head back to the Animus. What are you working on? Lots of different stuff. If you're going into the field, we need a way to keep tabs on you and stay in touch. Hacking into local security systems won't cut it. Thanks. For what? I don't know. Everything. You sacrificed a lot for me. You and Sean both. You upgraded the Animus, you helped train me, pulled me out of that coma. You put all that work into the database and helped me solve Clay's puzzles. I know I haven't been the easiest person to work with, and I'm sorry for that. I just want you to know that even if I'm shitty at showing it, I appreciate everything you've done. Maybe. Talking to the first Civ has always been a pain in the ass, though. Imagine what <laughs> it must be like for them. What do you mean? Oh. They've been separated from us by tens of thousands of years. A completely Hello there, Juno. Culture, Bye, Juno. Possessed of an intelligence vastly superior to our own. You really We're think lucky we'll they've communicated as much as they yet? have. Imagine what it must be like for them. What do you mean? They've been separated. Okay. Subtitles are really fucked up there. I have to run to the bathroom again. I'll be right back, y'all. Uh, if I can remember the button to push.
All right, I'm back. A completely different language and culture, possessed of an intelligence vastly superior to our own. We're lucky they've communicated as much as they have. You really think we'll finally get some answers down here? Okay, so she's Maybe. just looping. Talking to the first Civ has always been a pain in the ass, though. Imagine what it must be like for them. What do you mean? They've been separated from us by tens of thousands of years. A completely different language and culture. Possessed of an intelligence vastly superior to our own. We're lucky they've communicated as much as they have. Uh, let's see here. <laughs> Animals! Nuff said. I love Rebecca. Balls. <laughs> We've got a visitor down here. It's Juno. She's been appearing every now and then. Sort of flits through the air. Reminds us to guard. Reminds us to guard you well. Find the key. Blah blah blah. And then poof, disappears. At first, we thought it was just another holographic recording, but then your father called her some rather ca uh, choice words, and she glared at him. Honest. Swiveled those eyes in his direction and frowned. Creeped me out. I don't know if she's reaching out to us from the past, if some part of her is actually still conscious, or if maybe she's inside the apple, like some evil genie. Whatever it is gives me the creeps. And on that note, happy Halloween. <laughs> um, Hathos Amulet. Though I suppose Hatham's Amulet is technically a piece of Eden, it's not particularly exciting. It functions as a key, and, well, that's about it. I know, I know, we're all used to these things being incredibly powerful and thus rather dangerous, but this one is neither. Is is it weird I'm disappointed? That said, uh, it's still critical to our mission, so I suppose that counts for something. It's frowny faces. Good Lord, Rebecca, with all the fixes and updates and improvements you so you supposedly put into this recent software revision, one would think you ha you would have had the decency to include a British English dictionary in the spell checker. Some of us pre prefer to use the proper language when corresponding. The database keeps trying to replace the letters S the letter S with Z in certain words, and it's declared war on the letter U as well. Realize. Realize becomes realize, and color becomes uh, color becomes color. Wrong, wrong, wrong. It's all rather ethnocentric, if you ask me. Also, quite against the principles of the Brotherhood. Last I checked, and here I thought we were uh, we were meant to be an all-inclusive bunch. Just a quick heads up, replying to email chains will no longer return multiple instances of the word RE should you cut, uh, should cut down on single length, uh, on subject length considerably. <laughs> Are you sure about that? See above. Haha, -ha, very funny, Sean. Focus, please. Hey there, Desmond, as you'll see from the date of this email, which is November 5th. Uh, you've been in the amin an and the animus, the animus, huh? The animus for a few days now, but don't worry. I've been staying on top of your vitals, not even a blip. So it looks like extending the sessions won't be a problem. Whatever happened between you and sixteen seems to have increased your tolerance. The animus keeps you in a rested state, resting state, which takes care of fatigue, and your memories are vivid enough. We're actually seeing micro movement in your muscles, which means no atrophy issues either. Still, we're we'll be bringing out. Yeah, still, we'll be bringing you out for breaks. Just to stay on the safe side. So we've been there for six days. Okay. You really think we'll finally get some answers down here? Maybe. Talking to the first Civ has always been a pain in the ass, though. Imagine what it must be like for them. What do you mean? We've had this conversation a few times. All right, so we came from this way. Ad starts in six minutes, by the way. Okay. For anyone not subscribed to me on Twitch, you will have an ad in about six and a half minutes. 
Juno there hovering over the Animus. Like, you know. Like she do. Yes. Just thought I'd, you know, say hi. You have more important things to do right now. Jesus, Dad. What? What do you want me to say? I don't know. Hi, son. How are you? What have you been up to? I know what you've been up to. Nothing. You wasted away in some shitty apartment with a pointless job, while the rest of us were out there fighting to make a difference. Emotional Jesus, damage. Asshole. Are you thinking about hitting me again? Because this time, I will hit back. Let's just get back to work, okay? <laughs> Emotional damage, y'all. It exists. Let's stay away from the big glowy door for a second. Just for a bit. Hi, Juno. Four towers would be built to pull her fury into this place and dispel it. But even with all we knew, with all we had, it would take too long. A thousand years we could labor and still the work would not be done. The first tower was never completed. The project abandoned. We moved on. But while we labored on other endeavors, a few returned. They thought to automate the process. Metal might finish what flesh could not. If we could not meet the sun's cruel embrace, perhaps we might rebuke it. Already we could generate the fields to protect us in times of strife. But these were small and simple things. To replicate them on a scale the size of a world. We lack the energy to make it so. Half the world, they said then. It is better than none at all. We tried. Again, we failed. A quarter, they asked. Even this we could not do. A sixth, an eighth, a tenth, they cried. The answer was still the same. Perhaps in time a city might be spared. But it was time we did not have. So we moved on.
Well. Any more to say? Stop wasting time. Charmer. Hello there, Juno. Hanging out by the Animus. Hey, Rebecca. You really think we'll finally get some answers down here? Yeah, we'll let this conversation Maybe. take its course. Talking to the first Civ has always been a pain in the ass, though. Imagine what it must be like for them. What do you mean? They've been separated from us by tens of thousands of It's not years. Desmond talking. A completely different language and culture. Possessed of an intelligence vastly superior to our own. We're lucky they've communicated as much as they have. I don't know why they had to make this all so complicated. I mean, if they need something from me, they should just come out and say it. I've been wondering about that myself. I get the sense Juno and Minerva didn't exactly see eye to eye. I'm studying everything I can get my hands on, but maybe you'll find something down here that can shed light on the mystery. What happened between them and why? Add in seven seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Hey, Blue, I don't know if you can see me or not, but uh, hey, good to see you. If not, then I'll see you after the ad break. Uh, let's read the patch notes. Um, the downtime while you were in the coma, gone. Uh, so figured I'd do what I could to upgrade the operating system. It's actually been ready for what little while now, but with the Animus in safe mode, it wasn't, <clears throat> I wasn't about to try an installation. Smart. Things I did, actually, it should be we, since I had a few people in the other cells chip in. Modifications to the targeting system. It should be, uh, uh, you should be able to move in and out of combat more easily. Free running improvements. You're less likely to jump at the wrong time or in the wrong direction. Only one input for in interacting with the world. No more choosing between parts of your ancestor's body. Uh, you can assassinate while moving now. Definitely try it out ASAP. You can pick up weapons on the go as well. Uh, we implemented a weather system. Rain, snow, wind. It's all there. Animals, enough said. Faster travel. Faster, fast travel. Just open your map, and you can instantly travel to any unlocked fast travel station. Revamped the map. It's now It now provides lots of additional information, and you've got more control over what it shows. There's a ton of other stuff, but your dad is yelling at me to get back to work, so I'd better wrap this up. I'll hit you up on the other side as you come across new features. First of all, welcome back. It's good to see you fully recovered. I uh, can't imagine what it was like for you to trapped in there. If you ever want to chat about it, you just let me know. <laughs> uh, anyway, welcome back from the ad break. I was just reading a couple more of the email messages that I uh, skipped, that I sped through um, while you guys were there, because I didn't want you guys to miss any more cutscenes if we came across any. 
So let's see. There's a staircase here. So let's um. Oops. Nope, that's closed. Okay. That's closed as well. Get off, Desmond. There's light here. Does this open? No? Okay. There. It's hard to see. Oh, can I just like run up here? Nope. Okay. Yeah, Juno be running around and be popping in and up popping out. Uh, now that I'm actually here. Hi, Blue. Good to see you. Let's go say hi to Sean. Would you look at that? What is it? If I had to guess, I would say it's a counter. And judging from the iconography, I think it's safe to say when that's emptied, the end begins. Hello, Desmond. How's things? Same old. Another day, another ancestor. Who'd have thought <clears throat> you'd have a Templar in your family tree? I think he started out as an assassin. They must have turned him. Right you are, in fact. I've been reviewing our archives, and it appears that Hatham's father was indeed an assassin. Which means he was likely one too, at least for a little while. What else did you find? That fellow from the opera, Reginald Birch, Grand Master of the London Chapter of Templars, he and Haytham's father, a man named Edward, well, they were long-time rivals. Now, it appears Birch got his hand on Haytham at a rather young age, which is wild <clears throat> to convince Haytham to switch sides. I wonder how he did it. I'll see if I can't dig up more. There's a book that details it, I think. Hon honest answer, please, Desmond. Do you think we're getting out of this alive? I don't know. I mean, it's a pretty tall order. The first Civ couldn't save the world. How the hell are we supposed to swing it? We have some time. We have less than two months. They had decades and a lot more resources. And the worst part is we knew this was coming for, what, hundreds of years? History repeats, it seems. The first Civ was so busy with their war against us, no one even noticed what was happening. We get advance warning and then fall to fighting with the Templars. Lovely. Hopefully, whatever's behind that door will make a difference. And if it doesn't, well, at least we tried. Back to work I go. You should consider doing the same. Anything to investigate here? No? Okay. Oop. Get off the wall, Desmond. All right. Still nothing from good old dear dad here, huh? Clock's ticking, Desmond. Come on, son. We've got work to do. Hi, Juno. Anything from you, Rebecca? What do you think's behind that door? No idea. Do you think it can save us? The first Civ seemed to think so. What if it's dangerous? It's not like we have a lot of alternatives. And what's he gonna do? Who's to say he isn't in bed with Abstergo? Fair. Seems everyone is these days. Fair. What if we went to them? To Abstergo, I mean. Thought about it, actually. Showing them what we've seen, trying to work together. They must know so much more than we do, but... What is it? It's possible they know exactly what's going to happen. That they want it to happen. I mean, for all we know, they're hiding out in bunkers right now, waiting for the world to end. And then when it's all over, out they come. Hey, they Blue control. Cubby, thanks for the raid. Welcome to everybody. So I, welcome, welcome. So do I. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, how do you do the the shout out thing? Is that a thing that I can do? I don't remember how to do that. Is it like blueberry raid? Uh, Yvonne, how do I do the do the shout out thing? Is that like a bot thing or is that like a Twitch thing? There you go. Thank you. Thank you, Yvonne.
All right, I should be getting back to work. Yeah, so should I? All right. You were playing some Genshin Impact. How was it? All right. Here goes. Undan mizero het tanye. Awira awa unde yar don ja dagu. Tone wahra nagara de. Desajera ne rot niha. Nekti yate huwa yata ne kera. Aze gante jaja jera oni. Nekti ya otena de gari wasta kwe. Agungwe da su awa huwa nor don kwe zi niot ne sago de ya ogunga. Zewa jera sri at dizax ne hatham. Raganarun kwa kwe unte zi nito gwenyu. Nek zi ohondo yo ha wihtu ya de ha ganera kwe. Zinuero jokwa templar aguego tadinya rodar hoks. Ne onha at ketonis. Sigat ke su aria a ahigunsa gandanu agat kato dine sagaras ganex. Nice, got some levels and got carried. Hey, it's always nice to have a nice strong back carrying you around. It's all good. It's all good. All right, enjoy the walk with the doggo. Is it one day star? Hmm. Oni sajer ha. Ya otena guanek. Guanek. Radunha gedu. The water is chironiana. Runaju gedu na the ratu danu ya koduni. How it was? Next to dosa easy na kahanda di ya haze. How's everybody's evening? Or day, depending on the time of day. Yeah, awesome! It's always satisfying when that happens. Is it as a dot? Aska Degani Asa Gayeri Aska Dewa Nyawe <laughs> this is how you the negiga.
I mean, fair. Hits 2k, that's fair. Um... Damn it, Connor. Come on, Raton, look at Fine, can't climb trees. Oh man, I made a mistake. Damn. All right. Well, I made a mistake. Oh well. Do the what Karitsa Rooney? Oscar, Degani, Asa, Gayerdi, Wes, Yaya, Sada, Sadegu, Jotu, Oyerdi, Oski Warde, Degni Warde, Asa Yuarde, Gayerdi Warde, Wes Yuarde, Yai Yuarde, Sadi Yuarde, Sadegu. Hey, Konoko, glad to see ya. How you been? Happy New Year! <clears throat> I hope you had a great one. What have we here? How have you been, Konoko? Anything new in life? Wow, those feathers in his hair are going crazy. Familiar. Where have I seen you before? Awesome, awesome. It's always good to take time out and chill for a bit. That wasn't very nice. Let me go! Listen to that. He knows English. Small for a savage. You're spirited too! Yeah! We have questions for your elders. Only tell us where your village is, boy, and you can go. Best do as he asks, child. I could snap your neck, you know. A little more pressure and pop. The sad little flame of your life extinguished. You are a nothing, a speck of dust. You Ooh, you're playing Kenna? Ah! I'm excited to get to that one eventually. Um, it looks really good. How is it? shape of the future. They throw themselves at our feet and beg mercy. But not you, it seems. No. You cling desperately to your ways. Too ignorant to know your folly. But I am not unkind.
and so awesome, say, awesome. That you may carry word to your people. <laughs> Let them know the sooner we are given what we seek, the sooner you can return to your pathetic, empty lives. A fair trade, is it not? <laughs> what? Welcome, Melador. Good to see you. <laughs> Charles Lee. Why do you ask? So I can find you. I look forward to you. Yeah, this is my first stream of the year. I'd been out of town and I decided to spend uh, uh, last week get uh, catching up and stuff. Actually, while I've got y'all here, I have some announcements while I'm thinking about it before it gets too much later. Um, I have... Uh, Starting this week, I will be streaming pretty much every day uh, from around 2 to 6-ish, give or take. Um, so, like, uh, Monday I'll be streaming Assassin's Creed still. Tuesdays will still be Tomb Raider. Wednesdays it'll either be Terraria with Yvonne B and the group or it'll be Mirror's Edge. And then on Thursday um, will be me playing uh, Lord of the Rings Shadow of Mordor. Um, and then I might do some streams on Fridays or su on or Sundays. Um, I also have some future plans for things like D and D and stuff like that, but you know, schedules and all of that need to get worked out before that happens. But um, but yeah, Thursday I'll be Thursday will be uh, Shadow of Mordor, and then uh, like I said, Wednesdays tomorrow, uh, not tomorrow, uh, tomorrow t tomorrow's Tomb Raider. Wednesday is this Wednesday will be Terraria and I might stream mirror, some Mirror's Edge before that or not. I don't know. Um, but yeah, so that's my streaming schedule from now on. Have I played Shadow of Mordor? I have not. Um, I've not played either Shadow of Mordor or Shadow of War. They've been on my to playlist for a while and I've had them in I've had at least one of them in my uh, Steam library for a while. I just haven't had a chance to get around to it because so much other stuff has been happening. But, um, but, uh, yeah. Also, I now have a, uh, I now have a Patreon available in my link tree. Right, right down here. Um, a Patreon account. Yeah, uh, if you sub for, uh, so you can sub there or you can sub on Twitch. You don't have to do both. You don't have to do either. Um, just any, you know. If you feel like it, you can. Um, it's entirely up to you. Any money earned from that will be going back into production of uh, content on my channels and the things like that. Um, and, uh, yeah. You recommend a break between, uh, Shadow, uh, between Shadow of Mordor and Shadow of War? Well, I won't be, like, mainlining through them. Right, because I will be I will be doing it like every Thursday. That's what I will be playing is one of those two. Um, so like it'll be one of those things where it's like, you know. But we'll see. We'll see. If I feel like I need a break, then I feel like then I'll feel like I need a break. You know, I'll I we'll see. But anyway, so yeah, those are my announcements. And uh, Melador. The guy you wanted to have an arrow to the back of the head, I wish that was the case. However, unfortunately, Charles Lee historically does not die for a long time at, from after this point. Darn history and its immutability. Thank you. Easter! 
There we go. Goodbye, badass lady. Nine years later. Alright. Um, actually, I feel like that's a good place to call it for now. Um, I mean, it's a little bit early for 6 o'clock, but, you know, I don't want to get in the middle of a mission and, you know, you know. Um, so, yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, thank you all for hanging out and uh, popping in. Thank you, Blue Cubby, for the raid. Thank you, everybody else, for... Uh, you know, popping in and saying hi at the very least. Uh, tomorrow I will be playing uh, Tomb Raider uh, 3, the third of the classic Tomb Raider games. Um, social medias are available in the link tree. Uh, you should follow these amazing people up here. Um, my, the VOD, uh, the VODs of all of my streams will be going up on YouTube a week after, they, uh, after the initial stream. So next week, today's stream will be going up on Monday. Um, and, uh, yes, I saw the notification that Denoria is streaming, Yvonne. Thank you for the reminder. Um, I will be raiding Denoria here in a bit, so just hold on. A, uh, so don't go anywhere, y'all. Um, but, yeah, follow these amazing people up here. Link tree with all my socials and my Patreon and all of that. Um, Discord, etc. cetera. Um, and, yeah. Uh... Time to do a raid. Um, but, uh, yeah. Thank you guys for hanging out with me. See you all tomorrow. And where's the button I'm looking for? It's this one.